And also, ow, oh, did you hear that? That really hurt. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a what's in my camera bag for 2017. I know that this is more than halfway through the year, which is crazy as it's currently September. I just thought it'd be a good idea to do this video. And the sun is now going, it's just been chucking it down with rain. And now the sun's decided to come out. So now I'm doing a what's in my camera bag. And I thought I'd just show you, as some of you might be interested, that I will be using my tripod sometimes when I go out. But obviously I'm filming with this. So I'll do an overlay for now. And um, also I'm filming on my Canon G7X. So I would also take that out with me as well. You guys can't see the bag, but I will take a bag with me. As well as this bag here, which is my camera bag, I will take this one, which is I got from France, from um, Decathlon, um, and it was like two euros, so you can't really go wrong with that. So it's just this Canon camera bag, and it's like the middle size one, because I know you can get like a small one, a middle, then a, like a large. So I will obviously keep my phone in my camera bag, because if I don't want to take it on my camera, which will be stupid, but if I don't want to, I'll just take my phone anyway because sometimes I just like to put them straight onto my phone. This is my iPhone 7. I've showed you this already because I did a video on what's my iPhone 7. So I'll try and link that in the information card up there. iPhone. So it's just in rose gold. When I'm going filming, um, I need to get, I don't know if you can get one of these just for vlogging cameras. But I know that like Alfie Day's like pointless vlog um, takes... And Zoella also has like these tripods, but they're selfie sticks. So they kind of just, just go like that up in the air. But yeah, I'll just take this. It goes really long as well. Look how long it goes. It's not even going to fit into the screen. But look, <laughs> it's so long. I bought this camera about two years ago. I think it was November, so two years in November. It's the Canon EOS 1200D, which you guys know because if you guys have been on my channel for a while, you'll know that this is the first camera, the proper camera that I actually filmed on. And you guys seem to really like the quality, but it just wasn't very good for filming. It just didn't have fast autofocus or anything. So, especially with like filming, so I had to put it on monofocus, um, which is like a set. That you like set it on it's just this one and i use it to take photos i'm gonna try and get it to focus and i like this camera i still use it um but i just prefer the one that i'm filming. you may notice that i may not have a charger in my bag just because if you're going out there's not really going to be many places you're going to go that are going to have charging points for it so i usually just keep that at home and if i know that i'm going out i'll charge it um the night before or just as i'm about to go so i've got that bit of extra space for battery and then if i end up going out with friends i will take this adapter this adapter has literally saved my life I actually use this for importing my photos and videos from my camera from filming videos like this and um, I will import it straight into my phone so I know I've showed you guys this before but I'm going to show you again. You can notice that I have an SD card in here already um, but yeah I've got an SD card now already and that bit goes straight into your phone. I really like this. Yes it is on the expensive side but it's just so good for what it does. I've not really known anything like this. And as soon as they bought it out, I just I just said to my dad, Dad, I need to get this. I'm sorry, I need to get this. Got it with my own pocket money and I'm so glad I got this. It was £29. I know, £29 is a lot of money, but I just really wanted it. I will also keep a extra memory card in case. The second most expensive part in my camera case um this did actually come with my camera my big camera um and it's another lens so my main one that i i say the main one i use is the 18 to 55 mil on that one and then i also have this one which is 75 to 300 which came with it um it's a bit scruffy but i promise i've been taking care of it so it's just this lens here i'm going to try and do a close-up if I can show you. I've also seen, I know it's got nothing to do with this video, but I've also seen a cup that's made of like a camera lens. So it's got like a flask. I really want to get one because it's so cool. I love it. And you just like drink out of it. It's just, I love it. It's so cool. Um, but yeah, I've got this. Came with my camera. 
and my camera I now believe has been discontinued which is kind of sad also when I'm on this subject I have started a camera club in my area I really enjoyed it it's every Thursday night so when I upload my videos every Friday basically I would have gone to camera club yesterday but for me today is Saturday I don't usually film on Saturdays but I just thought I'd get it out of the way so um yeah I went really enjoyed it uh, we learned a bit of macro photography which is I'm about to get onto now and uh, macro photography is amazing I'd love to be able to do it like I think it's amazing this man came in and did a presentation about it and he's got some awesome shots of butterflies and dragonflies and I can't remember the other ones that he said but they were just amazing like amazing so the last thing I have in my camera bag is these awesome filters now you use these to focus onto the image um, so it blurs out part of the background so for instance if I'm going to put a filter on this camera which I don't think I can because it won't fit that Um, but it will blur out most of this background and it will just focus on me so it will be really good quality so I just have this bag, I try not to make them fall out I really love these, they are so cool I use these most of the time um, but I just would like to get more use out of them um, but yeah I just keep them in this little case they're from Amazon in case you're wondering I think you can buy them for like two pounds each but i think i got this for to like six pounds so basically buy three get one free so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and it gave you a bit more inspiration if you're an aspiring photographer like me and i hope you guys feel the need to or want to go and just do some more pictures because you just love what i love doing um so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a big thumbs up and that will let me know that you enjoyed this and you want to see more videos like this and yeah, so I'll see you in my next video next week. Bye.